Visibility graphic overrides of an element. Let's say I want to override any of the visibility or the graphics of a particular element in a view. I can do so by selecting the object. Here I have this uh, topal map, which is the surface of the Earth. Uh, and it's got this pattern. It's kind of driving me nuts. So I'm just going to select it here. And you can see it's topology, site grass, and it's going right through my building here. So um, it's kind of annoying me, so I think I'll just go and say, all right, let's right click. And now I got override graphics in a view. And now I want to override it by the element for just this one idea, one thing here. I can unclick the visible, I'll hit apply, and you can see, bam, it's gone. I'll put it back on and say, okay, there it is. I can go to halftone. And halftone actually is uh, putting like less ink down. So it blends in the element with the background color. And I'll apply that. And you can see that fades. And that might say, okay, I, I can live with that. Uh, and I'll put it back on just to uh, see what show you the others here. Projection lines. So like when we do orthographic projection on a multi-view drawing type thing, when we project lines across, we can set the object style of the, of the weight, we can set the color, we can set the pattern. Uh, speaking of patterns, if we had surface patterns, right now this grass is by material, so it's a grass material. Uh, we could put a different material down, uh, or maybe we could put a different color down, we could put a different material down. If we want to pick the patterns, we just pick this ellipse button or picker button. Um, transparency. Uh, we can actually change the transparency of this surface. Uh, so we can say, yeah, we want to make it more transparent. We'll give it 75% transparency. I uh, hit apply, and it's a little bit more see-through than, than it is opaque. Um, and I was like, eh, you know, whatever. That may work for you or not. So I'll bring that back. Now if I have a cutting plane that cuts through something, like a section, uh, and those section lines cut through something, those cut lines that we see where we actually cut through the building at, we can control the weight of those, we can control the color, we can control the pattern of those. And then the cut patterns, which is known as section lines, when we cut through an object and we see the materials of the object, we can say whether we want those visible or not. We can pick the color and we can pick the pattern of those things. So we can control all the properties of this element um, for this particular view if needed. So these are called visibility graphic overrides of an element.